What's going on, Budget Fam? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're gonna to be getting back to some more Topps Chrome from 2021. I have a blaster box here that I've been chilling on for a while. Um, and just decided today, I'm gonna to rip it open. Uh, I was considering like holding on to this one and stashing it, but just looking at how easy it is to get Topps Chrome, I was like, dude, I can get another blaster at any time, like literally any time. Um, if you go on the Topps, or I'm sorry, if you go on the Target's website right now, uh, blaster boxes are available for purchase for $29.99. So there's really no point in stashing it right now. If I want to buy some more, I can just go buy some more and put some away. I felt like ripping something tonight and uh, recording. So I'm going for it, man. So happy to have this. I've, I've enjoyed Topps Chrome. I've had some incredible blasters and I've had some absolute duds. These are really, really hit or miss. Like this is the definition of hit or miss. Um, but they overall, I would say it's been a lot of fun. So far, I've only pulled one auto out of Chrome, um, and that was out of a Mega Box. The Mega Boxes are sweet. I've only I've only opened two. Both of them have been great. We haven't seen cello boxes or cello packs this year. Um, the hanger boxes are absolutely terrible and they're way overpriced. So stay away from the hanger boxes. Just being honest, um, there's no real reason to buy those. They're just like smaller versions of blaster boxes but they're almost the same price so it's just blasters and megas are the way to go we'll see if cellos are out this year i haven't seen it usually if they were coming they would have been out already so i don't know. we'll see excited to get into this one today i'm not going to waste too much more time talking let's see what we can get out of this bad boy but while I am opening this, if you guys don't mind, just really quickly hitting the like button on this video and subscribing to the channel, I would really appreciate that. Um, my trash can, there we go. Sweet. I missed out on my um, Walmart run this morning. I uh, just didn't feel like getting up. But I did talk to a guy, my guy Josh. He was there. The cards ended up coming late. He was there, and all there was was... Donruss fat packs and mega boxes of um, Bowman Platinum. And those are crazy. I am pretty sure he said they were $80 per box for the mega boxes of Bowman Platinum. Now, to be fair, there is two autographs per box. So it's kind of similar to a hobby box, but still anything retail that's $80 is kind of absurd, man. I think it was only 20 cards per box too. And they're paper cards, so not every auto is going to be an absolute bank. I mean, that's just, that's tough, man. That's really, really, really tough. I'll probably be avoiding that one, but uh, you never know. I might I might feel like pulling the trigger just to try it out for the channel. So here we go. The first pack. Pull some bangers. Starting things off with Willie Castro. Gold cup. I weirdly don't think I've seen that card somehow. Brandon Woodruff, and here's our first, well, the only, usually there's only one of these, Prism, Refractor, Anthony Rendon, and then a Future Stars insert of Zach Gowan. So no rookies in the first pack, we did get our um, Prism parallel, those are always nice, love the look of those, so we're looking for Sepias and uh, Pinks as well. Out of these, so Josh Donaldson. Here comes a pink. Lorenzo Kane, Colin Arenado, and our pink. Let's see a rookie here. Nope, Patrick Corbin. So not off to a great start so far. This is starting to look like the blaster that I opened uh, a while back that had two rookies in the entire blaster. That was not a friendly one. Let's hope we don't repeat that. Ooh, what is that? Oh, 85. Nick Senzel. Chris Bryant. Maybe an insert here. Juan Soto. And Aaron Judge. 85. These are good looking cards, though. So, as you can see, still no rookies. Not on MC. Not that there's any, like, crazy valuable rookies this year, but you'd like to get rookies, man. Looks like we got a sepia and a refractor. Liking that. Rizzo. Tanaka. 
This is going to be our refractor, Jose Altuve. And the sepia. Jeez, man, this is Luis Ares. Man. Um, alright. Slow start, but we still have one, two, three, four packs left. Easily pull some heat out of these last four packs. There's our pink here. Suarez. Paul Dijon. Kenta Medea. Maida. Bobby Dalvek. He actually is coming on pretty strong towards the end of the season, so good to see that there. Bobby Dalvek. They just lost to the Rays tonight. But uh, sorry, first rookie is a good one. Bobby Dalbeck started out slow. So I started playing better towards the end of the year. Nice pink refractor of Bobby Dalbeck. Our first rookie is a good one. Nice. So I think we're gonna come on strong here, these last three packs. Mookie Betts, Aaron Nola, Mike Trout, and Fernando Tatis Jr. 85. Insert two more packs. Who is this brutal, man? This is <laughs> Shohei. Senshu Chu. There's another rookie. Turner Hawk or how? Sepia rookie Dean Kremer. So two rookies there in this second to the last pack. Added to our stack there. Last pack. Here we go. I think we're all out of parallels. Oh no, we got one more. Maybe a refractor. Reese Hoskins, Chris Paddock, Steven Strasburg, Refractor, and a future stars of Gavin Lux. So, not the not the worst blaster that I've ever had, believe it or not. But just three rookies. This is a good one though. At least we did get one good one, and then a sepia rookie as well um, a lot of parallels usually we like to see this stack bigger than this stack these are just the commons and these are the keeper cards inserts parallels rookies we did get a lot of parallels and inserts which is good but really really stingy with the rookies not again not the first time this has happened and it's been worse before but like i said this product is hit or miss it really really is you can have some crazy blasters and some that just are really underwhelming but it's always funny the way I love opening this stuff it's a beautiful product um, I love the parallels and all that stuff so that'll do it for this one guys appreciate you watching please feel free to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you on the next video peace